Thank you, and I give the floor to distinguished representative of Amman Center for Human Rights Studies. Thank you. Thank you, President. The Amman Center for Human Rights Studies would like to thank the government of Yemen for its commitment to the UPR cycle. However, we would like to draw particular attention to the arms trade in the conflict in Yemen, which prevents any possibility to improve human rights in the country. The governments involved in the sale of weapons to Saudi Arabia, the UAE, and Iran can no longer deny their involvement in the war crimes committed in Yemen. Continuing to arm these countries means continuing to violate the International Arms Trade Treaty, which urges the exporting state to prohibit the sale of arms that could lead to war crimes, affect civilians, or allow for a serious violation of human rights. According to the report of OHCHR experts, there have been serious human rights violations in Yemen by all parties to the conflict. We are referring to attacks against civilians, restrictions on access, arbitrary detentions, enforced dis uh, disappearances and torture, violations of the freedom of expression, sexual violence, and the recruitment of children in armed forces. The presence of arms and weapons in Yemen considerably exacerbates the, situ the situation in the country. Militias, principally armed by the UAE, but also by the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and Iran, today use weapons from the main suppliers of weapons in the world, such as the UK, the US, and France, but also many other Western countries. These armed groups then carry out war crimes on the ground without any kind of control. It is no longer a secret that weapons manufactured in Western countries are used by organizations that are classified by, as, by, as terrorist organizations in Yemen. Civilians are the first victims of the situation. We therefore ask the Council to adopt initiatives preventing further sale of weapons to countries involved in the war in Yemen. We, we demand that the arms trade treaty be respected by all signatories. We call for the creation of an international commission responsible for investigating crimes caused by the war and the aggression in Yemen. And finally, we call for the Council to foster inter-Yemeni dialogue but it's it, because it is between local stakeholders that a lasting peaceful solution will be found. Thank you. Thank you. And I give